I'm Celine from William Woodwright, your one-stop shop for pen turning supplies. Today, we're going to teach you how to make a slimline pen. You're going to need Hunt Ultra Gloss, Accelerator, Thick CA Glue, Thin CA Glue, Micromesh Sheets, Abernet Sheets, Base Plate Wax, a pen maker's multi-measuring tool, a pen blank of your choice, we've chosen Walnut, Slimline bushings, CA bushings, a chisel, an adjustable pen mandrel, a drill bit, a pen mill and cutter head, and a pen kit. All of this and more is available in our starter kits at penblanks.ca. Let's get it going! First, pull the brass tubes out of your kit. Use a sharpie to mark the length of the tube on your pen blank with a little bit of clearance on each side for error. Don't forget to grab your personal protective equipment before making your cut, like a respirator and safety glasses. Let's go do it. Cut your pen blank on the marked lines. Next, use the pen measurer's tool to mark the center point on your blank. This pen kit requires a seven millimeter drill bit. Secure your pen blank into a centering vise and drill through with the drill bit. Repeat these steps for the second blank. Grab your brass tube and a piece of 120 grit sandpaper. Scuff up your tube just enough to create a surface that your glue will adhere to. Next, use a sheet of base plate wax and push your tube into the wax like a cookie cutter. This will plug the end so that no glue can get inside of your tube. Grab a rubber glove and put a thin line of thick CA glue onto a piece of tin foil. Roll your brass tube in a line of thick CA glue on a piece of tin foil. Cover as much surface as you possibly can. Next, put your tube into the drilled hole inside of your blank with a twisting motion. Grab a transfer punch, or your weapon of choice, to remove the wax from your blank. Next, bring it over to your handy dandy drill press to score off the blank using a pen mill. Now let's throw our bushings and blank onto the lathe. Now let's get turning. With a sharp chisel, Start with light, slow cuts, all the way down to just shy of the bushings. Now it's on to sanding. Work your way through the Abernet mesh all the way up to 600 grit. Now let's bring out the shine using micromesh sheets all the way through the grits up to 12,000. After sanding, replace your metal bushings with non-stick plastic CA bushings. At medium speed, apply a small amount of thin CA glue to a clean shop towel. With the lathe turning, wipe the glue onto the blank and follow with a spray of accelerator over top each layer. Repeat the previous steps with layer of glue and accelerator eight to 10 times. Sand with micromesh from 1500 to 12,000 grit with light pressure just to remove the top layer of glue. Use a small amount of hot ultra gloss on a clean shop towel to apply a top coat to your blank. Use a clean portion of the towel to buff off the polish to bring up a durable shine. Now it's time to take these off the lathe and it's on to assembly. This is my favorite part. It's best to lay out your components as per the kit instructions for quick and easy assembly. And that's all there is to it. Go grab a starter kit. 
which includes everything you need to make this slimline and more at penblanks.ca. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to stay up to date for future tips and tricks. Ramsey wants you to share this video.